Okay, you get the tour by the aid package. We want to get a tour project.org. So let download. Go down to the middle of the page and select the advanced choices. And here you can select whichever uh, package you need. In my case, I use Windows, so I get the Windows bundle. And download it and install it. And I'm not going into that because they have good coverage on the site there. Uh, support. You, you can figure out how to install it yourself. I'm, I'm not going to take time to do that. Anyway, so then we're going to go to proxyfirewall.org and get proxy firewall. Um, if you'll notice, uh, I'm from Ukraine and uh, I'm Odessa, Ukraine. IP address 83, blah, blah, or whatever. But guess what? I'm not. I'm using the total plugin for, uh, for Firefox. Um, I have it enabled, which I'm going through the proxy. That's what you see in the Ukraine. Anyway, this is the Zydalia uh, interface. You can start and stop total. I stopped it now, and then you can click start to restart it. Also, uh, you can click uh, use a new identity, and that changes your proxy if you need to. Then uh, you can check the, the proxy network. Which is not necessary. You don't, you don't really have to touch anything once you get it set up and running. But I'll just briefly show you anyway. That's your your proxy connection. Click on one, and it'll show you the. Uh, uh, it goes through Frankfurt, back through Austin, Texas, back through Berlin, Frankfurt. Back to Bloomingdale, Indiana. Anyway, all this is not to worry because you don't have to touch it. Then you can hide it to the toolbar. And once you start up Proxy Firewall, this is what you'll see. You can set rules for each program on your computer. You can block all connections or allow all connections. Or you can uh, run through through the uh, Tor setup, which I'm about to show you how to set up, and run them through your proxies. When you got uh, okay, because I've already got some set up, so I, but I'll show you how to set up a new one. Click Add Proxy. I'm going to add the IP address 127.0.0.1 and port 90500. That's the, that gives you the connection to the Tor server. Click OK. And in this case, I already had it installed, so it didn't. Do. So when you uh, Run proxy server, uh, proxy firewall the first time, it'll intercept any of your programs. Uh, here's my mail server, I mean my mail client Pegasus. I'm going to click check mail, and proxy firewall pops up and catches the connection. So I can allow, pro I mean, allow with no proxies or block connections or set up a proxy server. So in this case, I would check the uh, use proxy server click on the uh, click here for to select proxy server go to the open proxies box proxy select the 127 local address where, where we set the Tor server up make sure you have this line checked click OK and as you can see, uh, it's downloading 
transmitters to to uh, process the mail. And then back in the uh, proxy firewall connection uh, log window, you can see it, it connected using the local Tor server uh, to the Tor network proxy network. 